All right, good morning. What's going on, Vec? Welcome in. So yeah, uh, very fl uh, smooth and fluid on the screen. Sweet. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't aware that it didn't. I mean, I know like when you change your OBS settings. Well, I use Streamlabs, so essentially the same thing, but um, it won't take until you have to close, basically shut off stream and then restart. So, um, cool. so a couple small things. Uh, I was in and around Mirror Watch when we landed up in Morthal. So, basically grabbed Mirror Watch. Although I think you guys saw that towards the end of the stream. But what I did uh, after stream ended was I kind of just trapped some souls because I felt like it'd be boring if you guys watched me trap souls for an hour. And we didn't go into Movarts because that's a death sentence. Um, but we did go around here and even up by Ustengrav and there's a really powerful necromancer up there and she had these robes and luckily they're enchanted and the robes of recharging but they're 200% instead of my common ones which I've now since sold which were 100% so I was able to go back to Mirror Watch grab the hood because I had a I have an unenchanted version of these, um, and I threw, uh, you know, basic magicka enchant on it, just like I did with my other hood, because the other mage hood, the regular ones, clip absolutely horribly with um, the robes. And then I took some just bloody black boots, I guess this is the bloody version, yeah, you can see the blood on them, because they're necromancer boots, and uh, just renamed them and started using some of those grand souls I have. Now I've only got two points into enchanting, so they're not great. So 15% fire. So I threw magic on... I have a bunch of gloves, by the way. Uh, so extra magic on the gloves. Magic there. Uh, double the recharge, which is nice. And for some reason you can't put enchantments on these fur cloaks, but you can on regular cloaks. It's odd. Um... But I, I made him necklace, so we get another 30 points there. And I'm still using the Mentor's Ring. Because, I mean, for right now, this is probably the best ring I'm going to find, unless I find something that's got regen with it. So, all spells, 10%. I mean, I'll take it for now. Plus, it looks pretty cool. It's, you know, Necromancer Purple, as I like to refer to it. It looks like a soul gem, or gems. You'll feel the difference? Nice. I hope so. Other than that, um, Staff of Soul Tearing uh, does what the Shout does, uh, but man does it eat charges. So I, I haven't hotkeyed it. And luckily, we I was going to... I want to get the uh, Fiery Soul Trap for this, because if I ever do go into one-handed, um, Fiery Soul Trap is by far the best enchantment for a weapon. Hands down. On a, on a silver weapon, it's it's fantastic for fighting the dead. Plus, uh, the fire enchant doesn't change. It's 30 points plus. Uh, <clears throat> but then you can lower the um, soul trap seconds. So I usually bring it down to like two or three because you, it's with a dagger you're swinging it so fast that you know you're not gonna need it. Now, I could see if it was on like a warhammer, I'd probably set it to like four. Maybe, but we're not using a Warhammer, so that's it. Um, we are a little tired, I and this just hit me as I loaded it up, but we're we're well sated, and I just had some elsewhere fondue. Lydia's with me, of course. Uh, go to the site of the ambush. The staff of has to. I don't know if we're able to take this on, but this is close by. We're right here at White Run. This is right by the old homestead. So let's do this, or at least attempt to. We're by Skullvar's farm right now. I don't know how good this is going to be, but but we'll see. Interesting. Yeah, I'm noticing. Oh, I was going to say the mountain flicker in the background, but. 
Oh yeah, of course. For Requiem, I put it at 105. For my normal gameplay, I set it to 95 and 95. I really should do the uh, mage armor first, because that's the one that lasts longer. Uh, we still have some effects of beef stew. And then we got about a half hour of elsewhere. So we get an extra 50 magicka, and it restores magic per second. I have to make some magic regen potions. That's something I don't have. Um, we do have 17 destruction. I was able to make these. We have to go on a nightshade run and a glowing mushroom run. Which we're going to do today. We're going to try to go to Shimmer Mist. Which is deadly because, you know, Falmer. But I think I can get the Chorus Eggs and the Glowing Mushrooms. And what I'm going to wind up doing is I'm, I'm not, we're not going to buy uh, the Tundra Homestead. Uh, that's just a Dindalad tweak needed? Yeah. I figured. It wasn't doing it yesterday though. It's weird. Hey, Big Head. Welcome in, buddy. Bet you're surprised I'm I'm streaming this early, huh? Good morning to you, sir. How's your mod coming along? It's Lod 16 distance, I think. Yeah, you know, I um I think I changed Lod 16. What did I switch Lod 6? No, I didn't. I you know what? I I changed Lod 4 and I changed Lod um Let's see, wait here, 4? No, I didn't change 4. I changed LOD 8 and I changed LOD 32. So LOD 4 is Billboard 4 and 32 is Billboard 6. No, I'm sorry, LOD 32 is uh, level 0. Because I'm running Ultra LODs. So yeah, if I have to change that one, I could just rerun my LODs in between stream. That's not a big deal. Because nothing's going to change, you're still going to have the three plugins. I'll have ESM, the ESP, and then I'll have Occlusion ESP. And honestly, it doesn't really bother me that much. Oh, the Ultra Lods? Re yeah, aren't they? You can run. Like, Ultra Lods don't really sap your performance as much as people think. Like, they do. But if you have any type of modern computer, like, say, like a, a 2060 graphics card and up, I mean, well, with the 2060, you'll probably feel a difference, but like a 2070, anything like an eight, any 8 gig card plus, you you should be fine with 3D LODs. And most people have, most people are in the 30 series anyway, or at least have like a 2080 or a 2080 Ti. I don't know how this is gonna go. I'm nervous about this, but we do have the nice regen. So let's um. Jeez, I'm just getting nervous about this. Let's re-up this. And I have some black souls. I did take... I don't want to level up because I'll show you the perks. I do want to do some training. How much money do we have? Yeah, we need some more money. Staff of Hasadoki. Uh, somebody's detecting us already. Oh, that's... That's this guy. And my Eek's here. So I don't think I could attack him outright. Especially if somebody's watching. But we could raise the body. Just in case. What do you have on you? Oh, 60. Oh, scoom. Oh, nice. And a pick of the lock variety. Elven Hunter Boots. I, I'm going to steal this off you when you're dead. I'm taking that. And an orchid. Alright, we got some things to sell. Hi. Oh, boy. Uh, running away. Running away. Um, armor rating. Fortify. This is the good fortify health. And 50% of fire for 300 seconds. Let's let the followers do the work. That's what this is all about. We'll take the bottled water. I'll show you what a real You're dead. Got your soul. Oh, soul embers. Human flesh. <gasps> 
Yes, we got an upgrade. Oh, and a staff of fireballs. Lydia? Why are you useless? Where's the other guy? Just a bandit. No, he had no I think we I think we looted him. Uh what do you have in here? Modig satchel, a grand soul gem. Okay. Conjuration, fragment, void salts, to raise the living. By Shagrub Gilgar. It's funny that like a lot of these books feel like they're written by orcs. Uh, one bit of advice is to tweak FPS stabilizer. Someone using ultra lots. I had to change mine up quite a bit. Apollo Grup, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. I hope I pronounced that right. I usually butcher everybody's name the first time. <laughs> or I could just say Paul. <laughs> Whatever you prefer. Welcome, welcome. Happy to have you. Yeah, it feels like a lot of these books were written by orcs, funny enough. Um, and I'll be honest, I almost redid this. Well, I didn't redo the play, but when I was going to start this play, I almost made another orc. That was going to be a necromancer. Like, same setup, same, you know, robes, magic. Uh, but orcs get a little bit... Uh, they get some nice benefits. Like, they don't have the debuff to the elements, like the 25% um, negative debuff to Fire, Frost, and Shock. Uh, but they've also got uh, Berserker's Rage. So, I don't know if that applies to magic, but taking half damage... Is pretty nice. Although I do like the... The, the Altmar just seemed like, you know... It made sense to me. Manny Marco was, was Altmar. <clears throat> so... And I, I, I tend to like the uh, the High Elves myself. Not the Thalmor, just the High Elf race in general. They're probably my favorite of the Elven races. Well, no, I take that back. Uh... The Snow Elves are my, my all-time favorite, although they're technically not a playable race unless you were to add uh, Race Comp. And uh, there's a really nice Snow Elf mod. Uh, I forget the author's name, but they did a really good job with it. And I believe it adds in um, Dwemer as well. Uh, I don't know if it's compatible with Anniversary Edition, like game, like game version 1.6+. plus. Uh, but I know it definitely worked on Special Edition without issues. I had absolutely no issues every time I've used it, and it's fantastic. And they look great. Uh, Paulo, Portuguese version of Paul. Well, there you go. So I'll just say Paulo then. Appreciate having you. Thank you for stopping in. To raise the living. Why live in a tomb? The child latched onto the orc's cloak with a gentle tug doing all he could to charm a response. Just as the Emperor has the blades at his side, so must we have the dead. And the staff? What is that for? Is it powerful? Oh, it's powerful, the orc replied. In fact, it once belonged to the wizard Hasadoki, a great mage who was said to have had... said to have no equal. If he had no equal, then what killed him? The orc glanced briefly at the staff's head as if waiting for Hasadoki himself to speak. Yet his countenance remained stuck in that playful stare, halfway between laughter and mockery. She would have to respond in his place. Ufkul Gilar had spent the last ten years contemplating the same question before settling on her answer. Throughout much of that time, her life had mirrored Hasadoki's, traveling the world in search of one who could challenge her. It was custom that bequeathed her the staff, and destiny that made her wield it. But even with fate beside her, the staff provided little comfort, knowing the ending it designed. There's only one thing that could kill a wizard as powerful as Hasadoki, she replied. Is it a cliff racer? A magic sword? The undead? Time. She spoke from experience. Time grew the day emptiness... Uh, grew the day with emptiness, and yet made all things seem fleeting. So long as it passed, contentment would morph into boredom, and love would fade into loneliness. As a necromancer, 
She had the tools to defy death. She had no similar solution for life. Perhaps the mortals had already divined an answer. For them, it was not magic, but children who allowed them to delay time's inexorable march. Now that she was a mother, the loneliness no longer consumed her, even though that was too temporary. And just as the staff was passed on to her by her father, when the time came, she would do the same for her son. It may have been why Hasadoki bound his soul to the staff, so that his spirit would be the one would be one with whoever wielded it. Ufgul placed the staff in the child's hands and watched as he scuttled through the tomb, swinging it around like a plun instrument. It's possible the boy would be free of the same curse, the boredom that plagued his ancestors and Hasadoki before them. Morrowind was home to a great many wizards. Somewhere in that group was a worthy challenger. And if not, there would still be time for the next child. Wow. Oh, we got a few things here. Bone meal, ectoplasm, troll fat. Uh, there's a few other... Uh, some nightshade. Oh, we got some blacks. I don't need the arrows. Now, can I raise you? Because I think you would be infinitely more useful than you. Ooh. Wrong spell. That would, that would probably be a thing. Oh, nice. So we could take that, we could take that. Take your bow. Yeah, I think, yeah, we'll just strip you clean. What about you? We have to go back to Whiterun anyway. And I didn't even see you. Perfect! I was looking for one of them. Can I carry all this? I can if I cast this. Uh, maybe not. Really? Well, we got an upgrade to the hood. Uh, which is perfect. Uh, major magicus. So we get another nine points. Okay, so it's only nine points, but hey. It works. It's the same hood. Uh, so this is gonna go on six. So you could uh, see we need to do a little bit of training. I think I have a carry weight potion. Uh, let's use a weak one. I have to make a few more of these. Alright. So you'll... You'll stay with me for a little while. Uh, we are tired, so let's go... Oh, and the cloak. Yeah, I had the white cloak on, but the bear fur cloak. There we go. And I've given, um... I've given Lydia my original, uh, saber cat cloak. I'm not giving you one, even though, well, you've got an iron dagger. Um, well-made short sword. That's even better. How about I give you a steel? You'll probably drop this, but... And I'll let you keep the dagger, because I don't feel like... Well, no. We could enchant that if we find banish or paralyze or absorb health. I think I have, abs I have absorb health. Good job, Lydia. Finally doing something here. Ugh. Did he raise? Okay. I'll take it. I will absolutely take it. Yeah, that looks better. That looks better. Yeah, definitely the black cloak. I couldn't find the black cloak. I was <coughs> I was looking through the menu and I just I couldn't find it. But now we have now we have the right things. So Oh, read the smuggler's ledger. Okay. Let's read it inside. The crows are going to annoy me if I try to read it out here. They're just going to Cackle over me. Seems to be what crows are good at. Cackling.
Uh, do I have a diluted health? I just, I'd rather get my health up there. I don't want to use the good one. I do have some. 13 points for 10, so I got a couple of them. This is four. Let's use that one. Magicka will regen on its own. But being being tired uh, nerfs my regen just a little bit, so... Yeah, maybe I'll go back and fix the lots, although I... I don't know. Like, those mountains really don't bother me too much. I know it would drive some people nuts. Uh... <clears throat> Good, we could sell off some stuff. And I think Lydia may have some things you like. that I need. Uh, do you, Lydia? Ooh, what do I have on eight? Nothing. Torch was supposed to be on eight. For some reason, the torch never goes on. Right behind you. Um. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Oh, we killed Ron the Crow. I gave her bouncer. So maybe this will help her out a little bit. She puts this on in combat. I still have yet to find a better set for her, but I did give her some better gauntlets. These are well-made steel soldiers, so. Uh, we need to find her good boots, and I'd like to get her a better cuirass, although we don't do smithing, so. Um, let's see what she's got for her. I need to break this down. She's got my two axes there. These are things for me. I probably should have put these in the house. These are all things I'll eventually enchant, and because I took stuff out of, um, Gallows Hall into, um, Mirwatch, because Mirwatch is going to be our home. Um, it makes the most sense. Gallows Hall, it's it's nice. Trust me, it's really good for a necromancer. But with that skeleton f uh, physics going absolutely nuts, it's it's really annoying. Um, but we may go back there if I need to make some black soul gems. And you can see I forgot to take all this stuff off her. So let me... That's for Isolde. And I may take another two torches off her. Okay. She doesn't have any books. Oof birth. That spell looks like it'll hurt. It might. Uh what do you have for sale? Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. You do? You have anything for alchemy? Oh, look at this. Ancient Nord Shield, huh? 180. I'd like to buy her some some better stuff, like this, but I don't want to spend 1810 on it. Oh man. Shit. 400. Let's see how much we can sell to him. He's got some decent gold. We might be able to make our money back. Alright, so... That... 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 A well-made orcish bow. Keep the rings. We'll keep the soul gem fragment. Um... This is the question. Do I pony up for one of these? I could, I could take a fortified barter potion. It's only 8%, but that may help. Uh, so 400 is the armor rating. Let me check what Good she's got. Business with you. Where'd you go? Lydia? Still here. What's your, what's your armor rating? Of course, Thane. How can I help? Uh, an extra 53 points. Um, give me this. Let's go. And... That spell looks like it'll hurt. I know. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. They're really getting 57 for that. Alright, I'll, I'll pony up for it. Oh. The damn potion. It's my last one too. Till next time. Everything you see, yeah. take a look. 
16. All right, not bad. Until next time. All right, Lydia. Thane. How's Carl? Trade. Right. The other part of my job. Yes, the other part of your job. Do you want a snowy? Nah, you look fine like that. You're good. All right. Let's get some rest. We're tired. Beautiful day here in Whiterun. <clears throat> in the morning, we're going to go... Uh, oh, let's see if there's any new jobs here. Collect dragon scales. Ah, uh, we have a few. I'm just afraid of how many they're going to want me to get. We won't be going to Raven Rock just yet. Although, potion to Raven Rock and weapon to Raven Rock. Ah, it's tough. Slay the giant at Secunda's Kiss. I think we can do this. I absolutely think we can do this. And we can get a Grand Soul Gem. We can get two Grand Soul. There's two giants there. We're going to take that. All right. You may think I'm absolutely nuts for doing that, but let's drink out of the well. Because, hey, that water looks pretty clean to me. <clears throat> is, uh, is my voice coming across okay? I was playing around with my, uh, with my settings again. Trying to make it so it's, uh, I'm louder than the game, but. For sale, huh? Interesting. Uh, Holda. Hello, friend. How are you? Um. I need a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Okay. I don't think we need any food. I'll show you to your room right this way. Alright, I'll follow you. I don't know if I have... I think I didn't add it. Um, the one where it's asking keepers to show rooms. I'm not sure that's compatible with AE. So The staff of Hasadoki would be something nice to have. Oh, come on. Does it only work in first person? Yeah, so you got to be in first person to actually get the uh, animation. Sadia, wake up, dear. Yeah, Sadia, wake up, dear. Sadia, yes, wake up, dear. Yeah, you want yeah, a drink? I see you. I see you. Well, it's on the menu. And let me let me turn to face you. Jeez. Depends. Are you thirsty, hungry, both? Thirsty, hungry, or both? You have any beef stew? You do. Do you have any raw beef? You don't. You have salt. I'll have to see what else I need for beef stew. I'm, I'm sure I can get it from some of the merchants. Uh, how many water skins do I have? I have to have a lot. I have five. I don't need five. Three water skins is more than enough. I usually go with two. Anything else I can get rid of? Um, do we need all this raw meat? No, we can nick some of that. It's just to get some carry weight off. Garlic and salt. Do you have garlic? Oh. Do you have garlic? She just says salt. Okay. Now, please, no more questions. No more questions, huh? All right. Um, let's get the vegetable soup. Perfect. Sated, hydrated. Well, I'd like to be full on that. We're saving the Eider Cheese Wheels. Once we get to Riften, wait till you see how many Eider Cheese Wheels you can pick up. 
It's amazing. These things are all over the place in Riften. The hard part about this is coming up with the moon sugar. So, again, there's a ton of that in Riften, plus the Khajiit caravans to make this. Um, let's have, uh, see, the raw meat's five, venison's three. Um, let's have an apple. Am I doing any alchemy? Oh, absolutely. If it's work you're looking for. Oh yeah. For? Yes, oh, we are we are absolutely doing alchemy for this character. I have the first two perks. So I can learn all the uh, all the ingredients. You can see every property that each one has. Now there's certain ones I haven't eaten. Like uh, the Daedra Hearts. Mammoth Heart. Well I could probably eat this. Um, let me save first. <laughs> I don't know if it'll kill me. But let's try it. Carry oh, carry weight, sweet, and fortify health. If you need Alright. Seems like it's all beneficial here. Fortify everything. And uh small antlers we didn't learn, huh? Okay. Food or drink, speak to Hulda. Now we're friends with Hulda, so I mean I could take that sweet roll. Now we did clean them out here, so apple cabbage stew restores one point of stamina. This is magic regen. Let's get that. It's always nice to have at least a little something passive for regen, right? But as as far as things I've taken, um, we've pretty much. I don't need the squash. I forgot to add the mod in to allow me to take the hawk feathers, but you take down one hawk and you get 24 feathers, so... Hey, we can always go to Solitude and do that. Yeah, alchemy's, alchemy's the crux of this character. Let's, um, let's chop some wood, because I do have a tent. Oh, yeah. Well, we'll borrow this for the time being. She's got mine. And I'll put this, I'll put the uh, woodcutter's axe back. I'm really waiting for the improved camera for the newest version of Skyrim. I, if you guys watch Feral's stream, he's on game version 16353, so he's a couple versions of AE behind me. But that's the most current version of improved camera. That's all those really nice first-person uh, animations that you see him if you watch his streams, uh, with the exception of combat. Now, I do have the first-person... I have the same first-person combat mod that he does. Which is very, very nice. Um, but sadly, the um, that version just is not. It's not compatible with uh, the executable and the script extender version for one six six four zero, which is what I'm on. Which is basically, if you install Steam now, that's the version you get. Whether you take the full AE content, which I have, or you don't, so. And... Oop, hold on. Because my messages aren't appearing on my phone. I saw something, but it didn't pop up. Okay. That was interesting. Okay. It sounded like bits are arrayed, but but we'll have to see. Oh, yeah. And you're probably going to need to... Oh, damn it. You're going to need to hold all this firewood. Still here. Because I don't have the room for it. How's Carl? Of course you will. Here, take these 12 firewood. Let's see if you sold us out. Let's go. Or we can go to her house. It's early in the morning. We'll make sure we're well hydrated. Let's see if she lets us in. She might not. Knock, knock. Is someone there? Yes. Uh, can I come in? Nah, I don't think so. Ah, but it's urgent. Okay, just. Hey, speechcraft. There we go. That's what I like. 
We can get rid of five weight with that mammoth tusk. Hey, Isolda. How are you? Good morning. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. Ah. Holding that invisible flag and I see. Yeah, I heard you're looking to become a merchant. Before my Ma and Da passed, I told them that one day I'd become or she's the best eating something, I don't know. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started. See, somebody's been peeping on her. Look at that. They they Or maybe that's a glory hole, who knows. Maybe I can help you with that. You do. <laughs> if you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about If you have to ask, just do a help Google search. A <laughs> I'm not going to say what it is. I happen to have a mammoth tusk. So, is this okay? Thank you. This should turn that old cat's gaze. Yeah. Maybe I'll be able to become a caravaneer myself one day. As promised. You know, funny side note, Gamer Poets released a video. I think it was early this morning. Maybe it was late last night, I'm not sure. But it's the mod where I can't think of the name of it offhand where it disables the eating uh, during dialogue. I forget the name. It's on his latest video. So if you go to Gamer Poets on YouTube, it's his newest video. I should probably add that in because that does get sort of annoying after a while. But like there's worse things that could happen. You know what I mean? Actual game breaking bugs. Let me show you a thing or two about bargaining. Don't want some shifty merchant giving you a raw trade. Yeah. You mentioned uh, the trading caravans. I've actually run into some. Yeah. These Khajiit make a living traveling the roads and selling their wares. It's got to be tough. Skyrim's a hard enough land when you've got a roof over your head. This is true. The worst thing is, nobody wants them in the cities. Nobody trusts them. I don't mind them. Yeah, why don't they trust them? I, they're perfectly fine. Reputation, mostly. Oh. A lot of Khajiit turn to smuggling and thievery to get by. A few bad apples spoil the bunch. You know how it is. You know what's funny is I find more Argonians in Dunmer than Khajiit that are uh, thieves. If you ever notice, well, yeah, Dunmer too. If I think I mentioned them, uh, they're they're the they're the assassins. The assassins are always Dunmer or Argonian, for whatever reason. I don't know. Uh. So is there, uh, what do you what do you know of the Khajiit? About the same as everyone else. They're the cat folk of Elsewhere. Yes. Great warriors, good traders. The way I hear it, Elsewhere ain't nothing like Skyrim. Ah. It's got tropical forests and dusty badlands. It sounds awful. Yeah, I agree. That, that sounds awful. See you. Well, we're friends now. Uh, do you mind if I rifle through your things? I mean, that's what friends do, right? Yep. You got any firewood for me? No? <laughs> Nothing in your chest here? What's that? We have some potatoes. Uh... Nope. Whoa, wait a minute. Okay, it, it has a bottom. I was looking at it like... It didn't seem like there was a bottom to it. It was sitting like this, and I'm looking like... I, I couldn't even see that it was so dark. Okay, never mind. Oh, I I kind of feel bad now just taking her, taking her shit. Not really. We don't mind. I don't think that guy's going to be waiting for us outside. God, I love this Breeze home. This is Eleonora's Breeze home. And there is a Lux patch for it, which I have in. Ooh. Oh, they're purple. That's right. Okay. Breeze Home was going to be the one that I... If I buy one in the city, it's going to be Breeze Home. Alright. We are... We're going to be back to talk to you boys in a little bit. Nightshade... And mushrooms. That's what we're on a run for. And remind me to save. Magus save. Because you didn't do it before. <laughs> Lydia, make your way. 
That uh, that bandit unfortunately did not make his way. So let's go this way. Let's shimmer mist. I think there's something else over here. I haven't picked up. Let's see if it's still here. Aha! The unspoken treasure. Ale. Four grand soul gems. Two greater. Some lavender. Six lesser. Some potions. We have raised dead, but I could sell that. And 25 thistle. And this is added by Little Touches Trees Outside Whiterun. I believe that's Blubbo's mod. Which is stuff like this. And let's look for Ice Claws. Sometimes they're in the most inconspicuous places. Yes, I have Ice Claws. Oh no. Oh no, the blues are coming back. The blues are coming back. Get them. Get them. Catch them all. They're like Pokemon. Come here, you. God, I'm gonna, ha I'm gonna not have enough room for all the extras I need. But this is gonna help towards our alchemy, so. Beautiful morning out, right? And uh, we haven't been by the farms. We got Chilfro. I believe this is stealing. Oh, we could harvest some wheat. That's stealing. That's stealing. That's st why was the first one not stealing? Huh. Well, I mean, hey, some wheat's better than. Uh, 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 I see them. I see them. All right, let's not go crazy with the. Uh, <laughs> Ah, oh, Rover Cucumbered again. Lydia? Oh, wow. Alright, what the hell? Oh, you can hold a lot of this stuff. Here, take this, this. Take the stuff. I'm... Oh... <sighs> It's not charged either, so. Oh, and I forgot to throw the woodcutter's axe. All right, we'll have to drop that back off. Um, that way is one. We could sell that. Hold that. I'm going to give you all my alchemy. That I've picked up. Two fifty one. Respectable. And raise dead one. Right. Survivor's Guide to Skyrim. To raise the living. We want that in my inventory. Light armor forging. Heavy armor forging. I picked those up. And Avar Stone Singer. These are all things that we can sell. And. Alright. I'll keep four. So we're at carry weight 245. That's, that's not bad. Thank you Lydia. You're, you're doing your job quite nicely. Did I cast the wrong spell? I did. 402. Perfect. Wow, the farms look nice. I did put a perk into evasion, so that should help a little bit. Are all these stealing as well? They should be. It's weird that that one version's not. Maybe I'll uh, report that over on the uh, Requiem Discord. Uh, for those of you that are curious about Requiem, I highly recommend you join their Discord. They are some of the nicest folk. Um, super helpful. I mean, there is no drama over there. They are just some of the nicest people that I've interacted with. And... Uh, 
I mean, they'll literally help you with getting started or anything you need. Alright. That's a burr. Oh, I did have something else on 8, didn't I? It was Firebolt, that's why. Let's use um, my Ice Rune. Come on, Burr. Yeah, help me get that destruction up. Come on. Let's uh, tag Mr. Troll. Let's get Mr. Burr up. Burr, you're going to help. Good job. Do we want Mr. Troll instead? Trolls regen their health, although bears, I think, hit harder. I don't know. Bears send them flying. Let's keep the bear. Let's keep the bear. I like bears. Oh, God. Alright. I'm sorry. I have to. See, I don't set up screenshots. I don't... I did the whole screen archery thing years ago. Scaring the fuck out of me, dude. Alright. Slaughter fish eggs. Can we make it across there? Oh, there's even more. That is perfect. River luck. Oop, wrong way. This way. Nice. 54 septums. I will take it. Hey. We'll take that too. Shimmer Mist Cave, here we come. Now, I have a lot of black soul gems. Uh, now, we're not going to be able to fill... Get him, Lydia. Yes. See if we if we stay back. Let my followers tank the uh, hits. We're pretty good, Lydia. The bear's coming. You're not. Come on. This place is dangerous. All right. Let's try to. Uh, there's a lot of mushrooms in here. That's what I needed the extra carry weight for. There are a lot of mushrooms. And we're going to try and get as many as we can. So let's get my mage armor up. And we're going to let the bear do most of the work. Now you'll see me sneak. Um... It's it's mostly so I move a little slower and to give Oh boy, yeah, they fuck. Come on guys. Shit. Do I have a poison? Please tell me I have It's my last one, cure poison. I have to make cure poisons. Come on, get him, here he comes. You can take the two of us. Come on, bear. Get him. Would a Chorus be better? I think so. Sorry, Burr. 
All right, Mr. Chorus. You are coming with me. All right. So we're going to try to get all the imp stools. All these, as many glowing mushrooms as we can. Now, Falmer, I believe, are going to be invisible. And let me save, because this place is deadly. Dead. Come on, there's another... I hate the hitboxes. I hate... I know there's a mod, I think, that fixes it. I I can't stand the hitboxes for, for that. For the glowies. I should have left that be. One arrow from these guys and I'm done for. Come on. That's you guys. That's you guys. Oh, he's got the arrows out already. This is potentially deadly. All the damn bandits, right? Take some bread. You, uh... Where's my Chorus? Ow! Okay, we're, we're screwed. Do I have a better one? I have a remarkable one. You need to get in here. Can you not get past this part? Come on, go in there. Alright, I'm going to have to send in... This isn't going to really work all that well, but... Let's try and get the Undying Ghost. This guy's interesting. He's going to sap all my Magicka. He doesn't last very long. Thought you could fight a Nord, did you? But he's got decent... Oh, he's supposed to have decent stats. Uh, Magicka. Shit. Well, let's get another summon. Look at the Spectral Warhound. Falmer ears. Ooh. What do you think about a bow, Lydia? Can we raise him? Oh, he's got a bow. And the whole place could come down on our heads. Here. You've already got a bow. Let me give you some arrows, and you can have a war axe. Okay. Very good. Very tough. You notice I'm using fire. We're going to learn all the elements. It just, it takes time. There's nothing I can do about that, sadly. Fly Amanita. Uh, let's make another save because there are chores coming up here. That's a mage. Did you get him? Good job. Falmer Mage, huh? He doesn't have a staff. Alright, we'll keep the guy that we have. He seems to be working out nicely. 
Moonstone ore. <coughs> All right. I also, um, <coughs> hey, Mr. B. Welcome in, buddy. Good morning. How are you today? We are we are snowed in. Let's make another save. We're snowed in today. Well, not really. It just it snowed a lot. Snowed in for me is different than snowed in for a lot of other people. So. Ooh. Look at the mists. I don't need the light for this. He made it in. Okay. See, this is where illusion would come in handy. I'd get them fighting each other. Isn't there a... Uh, there's a trap here, isn't there? Oh, wow. Moving. Of course. Come on. Lydia. She's not dead. She's just down. You want to hit him? Not with the bow. I can heal him, actually. That'll raise my conjuration. Let's get a magic potion going. Dude, do you not want to fight? <sighs> How about a skeleton minion? another one in here. I don't have heal for you, Lydia, unfortunately. Go get him. We got her some boots. All right, can I talk to you at least? You gonna get up? She's probably poisoned. All right, let's buff up. Wow, I think they aggro just about everybody in here. So what we're gonna do is let's switch over to my magic. This is my guy. Oh, here he comes. Really? Oh, they're the flying hunters. They're a pain in the ass. Shit. Yeah, here he comes. Lydia's still down. Alright. Do we have a diluted one? We're just gonna have to wait for this to wear off, sadly.
Wonderlust. Good morning as well. How's it going? Enjoy your lurk, buddy. Thank you for stopping in. Lurk away. It's the collision on the pathways. Gotcha. I have a sore throat for some strange reason. It was snowing. Yeah, we got snow too. Um, the roads are clear. It's just today and tomorrow. And I, I put my one car in for inspection for tomorrow morning. But technically, I don't have to get it done till the end of the month. And when I was checking the forecast when I made the appointment, um, today it was supposed to be 45 and 45 to 50 tomorrow. Tomorrow's tomorrow morning's when I'm supposed to bring it up there, but I may just reschedule f until the beginning of April. That's that's when I have to get it done anyway. It's my summer car. It's not like it's a big deal. Um. How long does this shit last for? Wow, four minutes and twenty-three seconds. All right, that's a problem. As long as they don't come up here, let's go into hiding. Probably turn the light off, right, so I can see. All right, we're hiding. Magic's regening. I was hoping that I could. Make use of that. We're hungry again, too. Huh? Do I still have the elsewhere fondue on? Doesn't look like it. I guess food just comes under the regular category. Hey, there we go. We got Sneak. We get extra 50 Magicka. So it's just a matter of waiting. Ah, fucking hell. And because the time scale in uh, Requiem's odd. That's 13. I don't want to use that. Let's use a faint one. Well, we got 13 of these bad boys. I'm still hungry. Jeez. Now we're sated. All right. I like to be well sated. Thank you. And I'm hydrated. Now we're well hydrated. All right. We just got to wait. Sadly. You're still down, Lydia. Uh, she's paralyzed. That's what she is. Can I proc? No, they can't hear it from here. I'm thinking this is going to be dangerous, but... How close can I get? I like to improve my alteration. But I need them to hear it. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. That's a beautiful thing. All right. Guess they don't see me. Still paralyzed, huh? Yep. I could talk to you, but she's not dead. <laughs> Man, their poisons are rough. Rough, rough, rough. Uh, just 
the food of requiem won't work during combat, if I remember. It'll it'll satiate me. Yeah, you have to eat it out of combat to gain the uh, overtime effects. You could eat it in combat if you're hungry. Um, but that's it. Oh, so somebody sees me. Oh yeah, the light doesn't work. How much time do we have left on that? A minute eight. Note to self, when you're fighting Falmer or Chorus, especially the hunters, don't get hit with their poisons. This is what happens. There's actually an add-on for Requiem to get rid of this visual. I, I like the visual. I, I, I don't really mind it. Um, do we have any that are three? Yeah, the diluted ones. I'll use the crap. I like to keep my health. My health is very low. I think it's like 180. For a mage, that's like... Stupid, ridiculous. Wow, see? Okay. Sneak's going up even. If I just stand still, huh? Alright. Fibla! Welcome in. What's up? Uh, game's going good. We're uh, on a hunt for glowing mushrooms, nightshade, so I can make some destruction potions, and we're in Shimmer Mist Cave right now, although I am poisoned. I got hit by the poison spit by a Chorus Hunter. Lydia's also paralyzed by a Falmer. She's... I don't know how long her paralysis lasts, but she's down. She's not dead. I want to be able to give her some boots, but, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll let her stay paralyzed for a little while. All right. We'll transmute my muscles. We'll raise others. Oh, man, we're, we are going to get some other so stuff here. Fucking adventures. Dude, Yo. Eh? You want to go tag? Feebla, appreciate okay, the follow. Some shit. That's the next best thing. Let's appreciate it. Welcome into the shadows. We are a necromancer. Zaranath. He is a high elf, although he's got uh, Mage Armor Rank 2 on him right now. And uh, we're playing Requiem. This is Anniversary Edition. I normally don't play AE, but there are some nice things for Necromancers in Anniversary Edition. So that's what we're doing. Sneak got up again, huh? Alright, we need to raise one of these guys. I need them distracted. That's one of my runes. That's my Falmer. And he's not doing anything, so let's raise the Chorus instead. Alright, will you go attack your buddies? Or at least bring them where I can hit them? See the two little red dots? They're gonna... Actually, I... If I turn the light off, it's a little bit easier. EMB light for these things, for Falmer things, is one of the best you can best you can get. Actually, can I raise a hunter? That would be even better. Yes, I can. Oh, look at him go! Oh, and Lydia's back up. All right. Careful, Lydia. Let's drop a save right here. I have the Shadow of Skyrim mod going too, so... Alright. We're not capturing as many souls as I'd like, but that's fine. Many, many nice things in this cave. We're, we're going to come out of here with so... Look at all the eggs. You can take the two of us. Come on. I 
I gotta be careful I don't get over encumbered. Wrong path. This is the path. Alright. So that's my Charis Hunter. Yeah, at least she's attacking now. Yeah. And when she gets, um... When she gets, uh, poisoned, it's, uh, or paralyzed, it's no fun. She, I gave her Bouncer. The mace you get from Ron the Crow. That was a good, that was a good chest. Yeah, I don't have a healing potion for you, sadly. Oh shit, they're invisible. Ah oh, crap, I don't have a... Fuck. <sighs> er, no. Oh, I appreciate that, Feeble. Yeah, I typically play necromancers. I Or vampires, or a combination of the both. This guy won't be a vampire. He will be a straight necromancer mage. So this is the Shadow of Skyrim mod proccing off. I survive only by the mercy of the gods. It would be foolish to step anywhere near drunk, drunken hunts. Oh, that's where it put me. Okay. Um, ignore the top. Dread paralyzes me from venturing near Shimmer Mists, uh, lest I encounter the Falmer again, so I'm no match for it. Okay. Give a holler if you have any questions. What did they take? My carry weight is at one now. Oh, they took all my stuff. I have my backpack. I can give her the boots. I have my staff of worms. I have... Alright, that doesn't really matter. We gotta get all that stuff back. Um, so this is how this works. Oh, did you get paralyzed again? She's downed. These are my arts. For a modest fee, I'll make great art for you. Alright, I need you up. You gotta carry this stuff. We're going back in to get my stuff. Uh, I got better boots for you now. I am sworn to carry your burdens. So she's got Bouncer. Uh, what it does is when it procs off, Bouncer will knock an enemy like way across the screen. Think of like the giant club sending you up in the air, but this one does it uh, horizontally. It doesn't do it every time. And she will put her steel plate helmet on in combat only. So I have it set up to where, you know, if we're not in combat, she looks like this. So she's got a mishmash. I did spend the money. Yes, I did. I spent the money to give her a steel plate cuirass. And now we're going to give her some Nordic carved boots. Which, thank God, she's wearing. Too bad they're not well made or anything like that. Same with these. But I'll give her what I can. And you are going to have to, unfortunately, hold... The oars, the pelt, and technically I'd still be over encumbered, so let's give her all the alchemy ingredients again. They took a bunch of my alchemy ingredients, and they took my naps, like my uh, my packs, things like that. Jeez. Uh, I'm even going to give you this, I'll let her hold on to the staff of soul tearing. Half of worms. Alright. What are my needs like? Sated, well hide. Alright. So we just need to eat a little bit of food, right? Let's have some beef stew. And you know what that means? When you die, you have to reset all of your gear. Gear only. So weapons, uh, armor, anything you've hotkeyed. So that was on six, and the Staff of Worms is on one. Torch is going to stay off, and I have Unrelenting Force. I don't know why I'm not using Unrelenting Force more. If you have need of hunting supplies, then you've come to the right place. Oh, wrong room. What the hell time is it? Oh, okay, it's afternoon. Oh, Rendir. What's this? Battle of Champions. Ah, that sounds stupid. <laughs> It pops off during a crit. You're probably right, Mr. B. You're probably right. 
They, they took all my, my pouches. Little bastards. Well, we're going right back there. It, what it does is I can't reload a save. Um, in your journal, for those that haven't used the mod, and I, I highly recommend it. It's a it's a death alternative mod in, in that category, right? So if you do get killed, go to your miscellaneous, and you'll have a thing. So see the top one here? Return to the place of your last defeat, Shimmermiss Cave, uh, near Battleborn Farm in Whiterun Hold. And it'll have a marker for you. So there's Shimmer Mist. We're inside Shimmer Mist, but you'll also have a knapsack. And I believe it's similar to the... What? Frostfall knapsacks? I think. One of them. You'll see it. You'll, you'll recognize it when you see it. And it also places a torch there if it's in, like, a dark area. Which is a nice addition. So you can see where your stuff is, just in case. Oh, all the blues are back. Look at that. All them blue butterflies. And what it does is it, it forces you to get your stuff back. Now, on occasion, while using the mod, if you get killed by, say, like, uh, an enemy that's 10 levels higher from you, they could take a lot more of your stuff. And they can give you a debuff, meaning you will have that debuff permanently until you go back and kill whoever it was that killed you. Right now, I don't think we have one. Just my natural, you know, highborn. And of course, waiting's disabled by default with Requiem. Uh, weariness. Hunger, thirst, and fatigue. Sp oh, because this is adrenaline. This will This will wear off. If I hit my needs, we're, we're rested, so we're okay. We are okay. I absolutely love um, Shadow of Skyrim. Really? Oh, there's a there's apiaries over here. And dragon's tongue, which we need. I won't take the bees. I will take some of them. Any other animals? We took care of the bear. We took care of the wolf. We should be good. There's Shimmer Mist right in front of me. You wanna... Here, come fight for me. I don't know how useful you'll be, but... Any little bit helps. The other day, a traveler from Cyrodiil asked me if I'd better be high elves. I wasn't entirely sure how to respond. What do you mean you weren't entirely sure how to respond? Alright, F5 save. In we go. Okay. Turn my quick light on. Yeah, we had a we we brought a bear in here before too, so. I can raise giants with this uh by the way. It's kind of comical. Actually, let me turn that off. It's not really needed. I forgot about this. There's fly Amanita here. And I missed this chest. Ebony ore! Oh, I'll take that. Good chest. What is my carry weight? 275? We should be fine. Uh... Entrances up here. Not very welcoming, but I doubt that's the point. Yes, that is exactly the point. So we've made it fairly far in here. Let's um. Do you have a weapon on you? No, you don't. Search. I I did search that chest. Some extra crap in there. I do not need. Okay. Into the grotto. Yuki! How's it going, Yuki? Good morning. Afternoon or evening, whatever time it may be for you. It's morning here for me. 10 o'clock. 
do you have a weapon? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we want you. And I should probably... I should probably hotkey this. I'm going to be using this. This will... This will heal my raised minions. I completely forgot about this. The summons, since we did go through um, Gallows Hall, I did get the Bone Colossus, but look at the cost of that. And it lasts 17 seconds because we're, we're not summoners, even though these are undead. Same with the, mil the minions and the ghost. But I can, I can um, heal. It doesn't cost that much, 38 for about 100 health. That's not bad. Oh. Go get him, Lydia. Kick its ass. Let me trap its soul first. Go get him. You don't want to get him? Fine, I'll get him. Got your ears. Do you want to come? Do you have a weapon? You have a bow. Ah, oh, boy, I swear to God. Useless. Right. You don't have a light. You can't see where you're going. If you do, people can see you coming. Well, that's why I hate caves. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this one either, but you know, I did not expect that Falmer to come that far forward. You have a sword. You will be useful. Do my bidding. Wahaha. -ha. I really don't think... We're going to have, like, all the Chorus eggs. Look at this. Hear him? Yeah, I know. I'm probably missing a few. Or not. Glowing mushrooms is what we want. What is my weight now? 186. Okay. Any baddies in here? See... Alright, so see the little marker? That's where I died. So, that's where my stuff's going to be. And if I can get it. I'm actually going to have to kill the guy who took my stuff. So, Mr. Hunter, do you want to come with me? Ah, there he is. Go get him. Lydia, out of the way. Come on. Oh, there he is. Come on, get him. He's running. I don't trust it. Maybe because I can't see it. He's running. Yes. So I guess we're going to have to random potato. You didn't have my stuff, did you? Which means I'm going to have to clear this cave. This is not going to be fun. Because you know what's in here. leave the centurion alone. Oh, there it is. Thank God. I have all my stuff. 
That's all my stuff back. See if I carry away, jump back up. That guy. Oh, and that farmer is regenerating his fucking health. Alright, I'm gonna have to use lightning on him, I think. Alright. Let's see what the best magicka is that I have. 13 points for 20 seconds. 30 points for 45 seconds. Let's use this one first. What he is doing a good job keeping him occupied. Let's use the better one. Nice, we could dual cast this. Come on. Get him. Nice. Good job. Take your ears. Nice haul. Good job, Lydia. Starting to earn your keep here, my dear. You're still po you know what you're poisoned, but I can I can I can heal you. Tired of the sight of the sun rising behind Dragon's Reach. Well, it only took one death. That's fine. Anything else unique in here that I may want? Not really. Oh, the cogs only weigh three, huh? Contrary to popular belief. There's actually plenty of game out on the tundra. It's a great place to hunt. You still hurting? He didn't seem to be. He's poisoned, but I think he's immune to poison. He's just got the effect on him. All right, let's make a save. It's energy drink time. Owl life, welcome in. Uh, are you going to play on death with this character? No, no, none of my necromancers use on death ever. Not one. Never played the mod. A farm in the Definitely not my I favorite mod of all time. My parents no. and become a soldier or a mercenary. They were somewhat supportive. Lydia. I don't know if he'll be able to make it out. Uh yes, yes I am going to be using on death. <laughs> yes, I will. Absolutely. It is it is my all-time favorite mod for Skyrim. Uh, mainly because necromancy gameplay is just super fucking fun. Super fun. We get a few more of these. Is he still? Yeah, huh? Oh. Okay. 
Shimmer Mist down. Very nice. There's the bear. Thank you, Mr. Burr. Your services are no longer required. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm surprised I only died once in there. Falmer will one-shot me. Did he make it out? No, but we do have a wolf. All right. So that is that's something a little bit different with how Requiem works. Um, Always good to be home. And you know what? I th here since I was a child. think there's a giant here. Ah, oh, look at the alchemy. Alchemy galore. If there is a giant here, we can. Giants are actually grand souls with Requiem. Whose tomb is this? Oh, this is the Shimmerous Hills Dragon Mount. Okay. Now, normally, if I was playing a better character, I would feel bad. And I would just leave the giants alone. There's a burr. Trap your soul. Go get him. Get him, woof. Nice. Hey, Talon, what's up? Love on death as well. Oh yeah, I, it's it's fantastic. It's um, if you just use the undeath mod, it, it's a little buggy. But if you know what you're doing, undeath is. Now I thought there was. Now I know there's. Maybe he's walking around here. He's in he's in odd spots. What is this? So he's usually walking right about here, right? What added this in? Old caravan? Ch is this AE content? Yes, it is. Uh, okay. All right. Nothing I can pick up. Dwarven Bolt. Oh, scared the shit out of me. I Maybe this comes on later during the quest. Which we haven't started yet. Unless there's something here and I'm missing it. You know, I don't see the giant. I do see a wolf. Oh, there he is. Get him, Mr. Burr. No, not me. No, thank you. Well, nothing to do with you. Let's, um... Good job, Lydia. Now you're earning your keep. Ten giant toes right there. We're gonna take all that stuff. Right behind you. Hell yeah, grand gem. Uh you're sworn to carry my burdens. <laughs> what else do we have to give her? Ooh, what'd I give you? I want that. Do we pick anything else up? Extreme blocking, huh? You can wear that. Uh, cause you do use a shield. She's sword and board. So let's give that to her. How can I help? I'm sure I'll find another blocking enchant. Some 35% is pretty good. Take your helmet off. Nobody likes it. You okay, bear? You didn't take any damage? Now how about this? 
raise. Let's heal him up. Good giant. Now he moves super slow. But it's fantastic. I've lived in Skyrim my whole life and never left. I'd like to visit Cyrodiil someday, though. My father told me to visit Westwald before the Thalmor invade again. Before the Thalmor invade again, huh? All right. Ooh, we're hungry and thirsty. All right, let's let's get some vegetable soup. I'm just putting in the last few mods in my Skyrim. Nice. How uh, how big's the list, if you don't mind me asking? Get back here, you little. See if they're in packs of one. Well, it's not really a pack, is it? Or is he right there? I can't see. That's the downside with uh, the True HUD mod. You really can't see where they're at. Uh, I guess I can up some alteration, though, right? We are in combat, technically. Oh, you guys wanna you wanna fight? Yeah. What if I trap your soul? Yeah. Come on this way. You little pussy. Alright, whatever. <laughs> F to the 5. 202? That's not bad. It's, you know, it's not about... I, I've been saying this for a while. It's it's not about the uh, size of your list. It's about what you put in there that you like. I tell this to everybody. You know, it's, it's nice to have all the shinies. It's not necessary. Right? So when I do my own personal setups, my own personal setups tend to be around a thousand or less. And it's only because, and like, but plugin wise, this, this setup here, right? So this setup here has 944 mods. Plugins, ESMs and actual ESPs. I have a hundred and I was just looking today. I have 129 of both combined. The rest are ESLified. They're light plugins. A lot of those are patches. The majority of them are. I would. I would dare say the majority are patches. Interesting. How is the weather out here? There is cool. Uh. Excuse me. I have what I'm comfortable with. Yeah, that's all you need. You're, uh, quite the character there. Uh, what's the problem? Oh, poor Cicero is stuck. Can't you see? I was transporting my dear sweet mother. Well, not her. Her corpse. <laughs> She's quite dead. She's I'm quite dead. Mother to a new home, a new crypt, but ah, wagon wheel, damnedest wagon wheel! It broke. Don't you see? Well, uh, okay. <sighs> I'm gonna regret this, aren't I? Some way I can help you? Oh, oh, oh yeah. I should have went into first person for this, so you could see the full dance. <laughs> Farm, the Lorius farm, just over there, off the road. Talk to Lorius. He has tools. He can help me, but he won't. He refuses. He refuses. <laughs> convince Lorius to fix my wheel. Do that, and poor Cicero will reward you with coin, gleamy, shiny coin. Ah, oh, boy. Well, if it's gleamy, shiny coin. Not the regular coin. Oh, yeah, I guess he is having a problem. 
Alright. Excuse me. You need something? Talk to my husband. Vantis Lorius. Oh. Or just Lorius, if it's all the same to you. That him? I would hope so. Oh, for the love of Mara, what now? So, yeah. Uh, that little man really needs your help with his wagon. That Cicero fella? Huh. Tell I me guess something that's I don't know. Crazy fools already asked me about five times. Seems he's not satisfied with my answer. That's satisfied. Why can't huh? he just leave us alone? Well, uh, I mean, he can't leave until his wagon wheel is fixed. That's sort of the issue here. He's right out in front of your property. Have you seen the man? He's completely out of his head. A jester, yeah. in Skyrim. That's my point. He's been a merry man in these parts for a hundred years. And he's transporting some giant jesters box. devalue uh, property. Ask the he's HOA. Bury his mother. They know all about jesters. My eye. He could have anything in there. War contraband, weapons, skooma. I know he's in the wrong he's neighborhood. Not getting involved in any. <laughs> Kidding. Uh. So I have two persuades and intimidate. That's interesting. So why do you care? You're just fixing the wheel. The sooner you help him, let's try this one. Yeah, why do you care? You're just you're literally just fixing his wheel. Fine. I'll take care of it. Feller might be nutters, but maybe you have a point. Look, um Nice. I, if you talk to Sister, Added dialogue, I'll baby. Down to help soon. He's nutters. <laughs> you can tell Cicero I'll be along presently. I just need to do a couple things here first and gather my tools. Oh yeah? You guys know what happens if uh you get turn Cicero into the guards and you don't talk to Lurius, right? You have done that option? Has, has everybody here um, help, I, I usually help Cicero. I tend to play less savory characters, shall we say. But, on the off chance that I do have, see my giants all the way over there? He's still... Let's, let's get him off. Because um, he's not going to be able to follow me, so let's just get out on a Spectral Warhound out. And he'll drop down, so... Ugh. Okay. Alright. I never... I, yeah, I... I think I've, I've done the opposite. Uh, maybe... Three times since this game released. I won't spoil it for those who haven't... Turn... Who... Who haven't turned him in. Right? But let's just say it's interesting. Alright, so I talked to Lurius. He's agreed to fix your wagon wheel. So you'll be all set pretty soon. You you did? He has? What's up, Kush? 539 mods for the win. Uh, my mod pack makes Cicero look like... Oh, are you running Pandorable Mails for him? With the nice face paint and everything, I like that version best. I'm uh, I'm not running any NPC overhauls in my game. Surprisingly. Ah, I'll eat him. Smile with his eyes closed. All right, what are you giving me? Fifty septums. Okay. I will wait for Lorius. Oh yes, mother and I will wait right here, right here until he fixes our wheel. All right, you do that, and I'm gonna—I'm just gonna be on my way then. Okay. You good, Lydia? F5. All right. Well, the giant won't come. I will wait for Lorius. Oh yes, Ooh. mother and I. You could actually steal his horse. <laughs> nah, I better not. We—we uh, we don't want to get in with. We don't want to get in uh, the, I should say, the wrong way with certain uh, people. Let's just leave it at that. I do have Unrelenting Force on. Yes, I do. Let's go to the uh, the Watchtower here. Let's see if we can trap a few souls. We'll let the guards take care of banditos. They should appear. Now, if they appear and attack me, I'm screwed. Ah, damn it. 
Come on, guys! I could even trap one soul. I'm gonna start collecting silver arrows, because I'm gonna give her a bow. I should have kept that well-made orcish bow for Lydia. Something to fall back on. And maybe even the iron arrows, just for the hell of it. Wait. You don't know me. I know you. No, you don't. You know nothing of me. Ooh. Nah, man, we're, Tomato we're soup. So many fucking adventures. Dude, let's go tag team some business, adventures. Right? Yes, Kush. Hey, okay, appreciate the follow. Next, next best thing. Welcome into the shadows, my friend. Uh, Beijing NPCs, interesting NPCs, pan NPCs too. Nice. So, all right, I just to kind of show you something, right? So this is my Lydia. Right. Now, I don't have any dedicated NPC overhauls, including my own character. Now, he's got flesh on him and everything. I, I do have KS hairs, I have Apache hairs, and I have the Spid versions for, for those as well. Um, but as far as something like, say, Beejin, Northborns, Pandorables, um, what's the other popular ones? I'm trying to think. Oh, I lied. I have one for interesting NPCs because it's the only one that handles it. It doesn't affect records. It's just a straight-up replacer. But my NPCs are all based on the mod High Poly Head, which you could find at Vector Plexus. Most of you guys are probably familiar with that mod anyway. Um, all I have are male and female 4K skin textures. It's one of the only things I've got oh, 4K we're, in my game. So many Dude, let's Alex. Or Alexis. Alexis plays. Appreciate the follow. Welcome in. Um, yeah, it's based on high poly head. Um, and it does distribute the hairs not only to my own character, but to NPCs. Although the NPCs don't have the physics versions. My character is the only one that has the hair physics. Um, 4K male and skin, uh, male and female skin textures. 4K for both the Khajiit and the Argonians. And then all I've changed is I've got uh, Eyes of Beauty. I've got uh, Meekin Eyes. And I believe I've got uh, Eyes of Beauty for the vampires as well. There's a Oh, and uh, beard, like beards and brows and scars, things like that. But they don't affect any of the records, so I'm guaranteed to never have the dark face issue. Um, nor is it going to change any like weird values, or they'll have mismatched armors, things like that. That I'd, and the best part about it is I don't have to worry about any patching. I could set my NPCs up. It's it's about 12 to 15 total mods. That's it, and then I just leave them alone, and I'm I'm done with that entire category. And they all look pretty good. Now, some of them are going to have ridiculous hair. I'm okay with that. To not have to go through, like, the patching nightmare. Not have to worry about, like, go getting into the game. I don't have to run the dark face issue reporter. None of that stuff. Who's got the greatsword? You? You raise. You become my minion. We got some Wait, training. to. No. You. No, you don't. You don't know me. And let's do this while we're over by the Tundra homestead. Um, let's plant some of these glowing mushrooms. The reason is you get to use the Hearthfire um, stuff from Tundra homestead for free without even buying the house. There goes the long ears. He's lucky I'm... Uh, I've got stuff to do. You could buy it if you want to. I'm not gonna. And then you get to harvest them for free. So, let's... Oh, did I give her... Well, I have enough here. Oh, you can only plant one at a time. Oh, okay. Is that what it said? Oh, there, planted. Okay. So we'll make the whole back row 
I can't play it more than one item at a time, but it seemed to take two. That's fine. Um, where's, where's Lydia? Why are you here? Come here. Do you have any nightshade for me? Thane. House Carl. I did give her all my alchemy stuff. Which I should probably take back. Give me this. Uh, that might be a bad idea. We gotta store all this stuff back at our house. And do I have anything for you? No, but we were gonna give her that. Oh, and I don't have my hood on. Let's go. Keeping my hood on, because I do have frostfall running, uh, would probably be a good idea. Mr. Bandit, uh, get off my garden. That's not really my garden. Uh, what are we gonna plant here? Let's see. What could we use? Canis root. Sure. I only have one. Uh, imp stool. Let's plant. Um, some steel blue antiloma. And let's also plant... Do we have nightshade? Let's plant some nightshade there. So this will constantly respawn throughout my gameplay. It's very nice. I downloaded the extended... I have that in here, actually. Uh, it's one of the mods I wanted to add. I do have extended cut. Let's get all these blues. Well, not all of them. We'll take as many as I can carry. So, I think what we'll do is we'll take the carriage to Morthal. That's ah, a beautiful evening. I love when it's not raining in my game. I was really hoping I could have trapped some of those bandits. Um, we didn't read the ledger, did we? No, we didn't. This is the missive. We're going to keep this. Maybe we'll do this now. Uh, to all able-bodied men and women of Whiterun, the giant at Secunda's Kiss has been harassing Ra... Alright, so... Whoever slays it. Yeah, we'll do that. Smuggler's Ledger. Items. Dozen, dozen bottles of skooma delivered to Delvin Mallory and Riften. Smuggler's fee, 50 septums and a favor. Knowing Delvin, the discount is worth it. At least this time around. Items. Staff of Hasadoki Void Salts, Soul Gems, and Bone Meal. Delivered to Ivara of Olenfeld and Lushak Gra Ragdom. Brittle Shin Pass. Smuggler's fee. Just gold and gems for now. It was tough sneaking in some of the items on the list, but the zombie lovers uh, were happy with the haul. They say they're trying to open a portal to something called the Soul Karen. If there's loot to be had inside, it might be a good idea to line up some buyers. Alright. Items. Cane and Book. Delivered to Bandits, White River Watch. Smuggler's Fee. Hajvar paid with a dagger and some farmer clothes, with the, with the blood still on it. <laughs> The cane was a foot short, but it serves the bastard right for not paying in gold. I told him if he wants better service, he's going to have to learn how to fight with his eyes open. Um, uh, and that looks to be everything. Okay. Find the necromancers of British- ooh, boy. We are going to do the rising dead as well. But we are going to slay a giant. And I'm thirsty. So let's uh let's have some venison stew. Yeah, we're hydrated. There we go. Venison stew. We are a little tired though. So just on the edge of being tired. Can we cross here? Ah uh, yeah, it's shallow enough. Um I'm running NLA Weathers. This is the version by Lou. 
or Lu Ping. And uh, Paicho EMB. With some tweaks on my end, because it sort of needs it. But it's a fantastic EMB. There's actually a lot of support for weather mods with Paicho. And it's uh, surprisingly light uh, for performance wise. <coughs> Granted, now, I, I know I say it's surprisingly light. It's also going to be based on your weather mod. So. The version for Cathedral Weathers, which is what I was testing and which I'm building a reshade for, is on the heavier side. Same as if it was for, you know, NAT 3.0, the weather plugin only, not the ENB, just the weather plugin. Uh, it's got a lot of stuff in each of the files. NLA is a very, very light weather mod, which also allows you to customize uh, your own stuff around it, too. So it's nice. It is nice. Simple. Pack of wolves, you say? And these are pit wolves. These aren't just any wolves. Son of a bitch. And I better run. Oh. Or uh, Mr. Bandito can do his job. Sweet. Necromantic empowerment for you, good sir. Suddenly I feel much better. <laughs> All right. Take the hearts. Hearts can be used in alchemy. I forgot to, uh... Oh. The bouncer, huh? Note to Adril, huh? Take the poultice, why not? Uh, where is it? Note to Adril. Adril. I need you to go out and find the missing pit wolves before the next tournament. We lost too many during the last fights, and we won't be able to train new ones uh, in time. Find them and bring them back to Crags Lane at once. Okay, well. Uh, Mr. Bouncer, I don't need your note. Uh, you can hold on to that. And uh, sorry about your death and stuff. Not really. Alright, let's buff that up. Oh, so he's the first giant. Thank God. This will be a little bit easier, I think. Uh, uh, yep, it's him. Sweet. I think there's a couple giants here. Oh man, we're, we are gonna get into so many fucking adventures, dude. Let's go tag team some bitches. Yo. Let's get some necromantic empowerment on this guy. Good job. Collect the bounty. We got 10 more toes, baby. And 210 septums. Something aggroed? El Taco! Appreciate the follow. Welcome into the shadows. Uh, I was actually watching someone who used Paicho to make people look like they have cell shading. Interesting, Mr. B. Was that somebody on YouTube or Twitch? Also, if you guys, um, if you don't know, Mr. B uh, and uh, I believe if Big Head's still here, they're both also mod authors. Um... So feel free to check them out uh, on their Nexus page. I believe Mr. B and Big Head, they're under the same name as they are here. They both make mods, and uh, Big Head streams here on Twitch. Um, so, uh, Mr. B, did you switch over to YouTube? I'll shout out Big Head, because I know Big Head's here. Oh, because I put the wrong damn command in. See that? Pro streamer, right? I'll be switching to YouTube. All right, I'll have to update your uh, your link for you then. But I, if you guys search Mr. B1969 on YouTube, you'll be able to find his content. I believe he's already got some. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. All right, we may as well take the other giant out too, right? We're in combat with somebody else. Who the hell else are we in combat with?
Can't be the giant, right? Oh, come on, hit him. Alright, go after them. Alright, I have no magicka. And let's fortify destruction. Jesus! Oh, it's a fucking wolf. It's a fucking ice wolf. Shit. Uh, I need a good one. Ah, oh, shit. Remarkable. Run away. Oh! He's gonna hit me. I'm not dead. I will be. Mother. Come on, run! Run! <sighs> oh my god. Jeez, he just keeps. Hold on, I need a better heal. Uh, stamina. Come on. Yeah, they get anywhere close to you and, like, you're screwed. You know what? Here. Play with your buddy. Play with your buddy. Go get your friend. Go get him. Oh, man, he's got a murder boner for me. Alright. Well, that's not gonna work. Up, bandito. Ah, uh, he's on my ass. Look at him. <laughs> this sucks. There we go. Eat it. All right, Lydia's just stunned. Ten more toes. Three hundred thirteen septums. <sighs> I swear I was gonna. Really? Come on, dude. Oh, he's just stuck in place now. All right, whatever. Oh, he's dead. Traveling with the Nord. How about that? Yeah, how about that? Save. That, yeah, absolutely stressful. I have content going back at least four years. I figured. I figured you did. And we can, um, we could take some mammoth cheese. Mammoth cheese is actually pretty good. Um, you know, it's not the best. It's not like stews, but one on. point of health for 300 we seconds, that's not bad. That at some point if you'd like. It has me somewhat concerned. Alright. Let's try and break into this apprentice chest here. There we go. First try, baby. Oh, boy. Uh, I need you to carry burdens, Lydia. Burdens. I was going to give you some. Oh, you don't have I don't have a bow to give you. Uh, but here. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Yes, yes you are. All right. So we need to make it back to our house. Yeah, see him there? He's just... I wonder if I can get away with this here. Alright. I just don't like them running in place. It's annoying to me. Yes, gods only know. 
That pit that that wasn't the pit wolf. That was an ice wolf. That was the one that was up top there. That kind of hangs out by the light. It's two silver veins right there. If you guys need silver early on. And uh, let's take the bouncer with us, right? Does he have? Yeah, he's got a warhammer. We'll raise him. We'll see if he does any good. He might. He might not. All right, off to the carriage stop. May have to turn my lantern light up just a bit. I mean, it's supposed to be dark on the outside, but what can you do? Ooh, Ludamots. See, all the all the things that fly and flutter, pick them up if you like alchemy. Hey, I saw you. Get out of the rocks. <laughs> Uh, it's coming up here. Can we go to Morthal with this? I believe we can, right? Oh, no, we can't because Morthal's an actual stop. Well, let's try. Yeah, see, because you've got an actual carriage here that'll take you right to Morthal. You've gotten a custom We're going to go to Mirwatch. But I still think you need my help with a few things. You're not wrong. Hello, good sir. Need a ride? Yes. Uh, I need to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Uh, you are going to take me to oh, 200 gold. That's highway robbery. Climbing back and we'll be off. Always told me to stay away from them. Jeez. Never knew why, but I listened. All right, we'll drop a save before we do the traveling. Anytime you... Carriages are technically fast travel, so... You know, use it. Use the save. We didn't uh, we didn't pick up a lot of nightshade. Anybody know where there's a good supply of nightshade? Oh, and I do want to see if uh, Falion is awake. I haven't seen your face before. No, you haven't. I'm watching you. All right, you watch me. Nummy sweet rolls. Don't buy into all that Thalmor nonsense, right? Right. Yeah, we're no friends of the Thalmor. Just a few more hours, and I can crawl under some furs. Valian. Ah, you dirty bastard. All right, that's fine. We'll just go to our house. We'll come back, and we'll we'll chat with him later. Mirror watch. Is a stone's throw away from Orthol. If I can make it past the damn trees. There it is. We're using this as our home. I was going to use Gallows Hall, but like I said before, it was a. Uh, there was a skeleton that was having some physics issues, and it was annoying the ever living hell out of me. So. We switched. And this one has a marker. Gallows Hall, for whatever reason, doesn't have a marker. You would think it would, but it doesn't. And time of day. Uh, let's get let's get my alchemy stuff situated first. Just pack everything in. And anything I have to disenchant. Which I don't think I have any. I don't. Do I have anything to enchant? No, we're saving that. Okay. So, I am keeping my ingredients in Mr. Strongbox here. I have a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Okay. Anything I could place on the, uh... Oh, yeah, see, I, like I said, I had a extra manic, uh, extra set of robes. They're unenchanted. Um, that's Silver Hand. I have a Dwarven Bolt. And you also have, um... 
Still here. You have something that I want to take off you. Actually, I want to take all your stuff. Let's go. Let's put the crafting stuff where we can. I believe I can use the bags here, right? The knapsack. Well, here, let's do this. Yeah, there's a tanning rack right over here. So let's make some leather. Now I only have the first rank of uh, smithing, I have craftsmanship, which I don't think I'm going to be able to make a lot of stuff. Snow bear fur cloak. Of course I do have the twilight princess stuff, but I mean look how OP this is, right? Health regen regenerates 50% faster, stamina by 20. Damage with ranged, damage by one handed, damage by two handed. I mean, it's just, you know. Conjure, like, this is all spells, another 10%. It's kind of, it's kind of OP. 300% faster regen? Yeah. No, thank you. Alright. And, uh, I guess we'll use, either, eh, we'll use the knapsack for this. So the bones, the scales, the cogs, the ore, gold. Um, I'll keep the linen wraps. What else do we take off her? Oh, all the weapons. Yeah, this is stuff I wanted to... So, the Staff of Soul Tearing, I, I wanted to pop this up somewhere. Oh, no, give that back. <laughs> Probably place it over here. Oh, this is for Uniques. These we can sell. I'm keeping the staff of worms for obvious reasons. I believe I can break this down. Okay. So what can we put on an iron dagger, huh? Absorb health. How about a Quicksilver Dagger? Same thing. How about a Steel Dagger? It is the best chain, right? What's Moonfire? Yeah, nothing compares to Absorb Health. Aside from Paralyze and Banish. And even one of these Woodcutter's Axes. Well, maybe not. Yeah, maybe we should. Alright. Uh, we need sleep. Did you know that being in jail affects your skills in Skyrim? Yes. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. 
let's get about seven hours. I'd like to be able to talk to, well, a few. I'd like to be able to talk to Falion. All right, can we have some beef stew? Do I have enough carry weight? How about with this? Oh, it's back to the gallery. Um, books. Use the bookshelf. Heavy, ooh, it's full. Okay. Cool, second shelf. Uh, light armor forging. Lunar forge. Need that. Sell that. Need that, need that. Need that, okay. Let's hope Thalion is home and awake. Take that off, Lydia. Take your help, good girl. Yeah, see, I, I'm afraid that uh, Mirror Watch may not have the keyword for. Um, to allow you to sleep, like, or maybe the bed that I slept in wasn't by a fire. Maybe it does, and I'm just, I don't know. I'm looking at the wrong meter. Come on, Falion. I think I hear another Nern route. No answer. Damn it. Alright. Um, that's a problem. I don't have any overhauls that make, you know, there's no smith here or anything like that. So let's take the care. I do have carriage stops of Skyrim. So let's look here. Uh, we gotta go back to Brittleshin anyway, so I guess it's back to Whiterun. We could go to Riverwood. Riverwood would actually be better. It's a little closer. So let's go to Riverwood. And I hear a dragon. Yeah. Uh. Riverwood. Cool. So we are a little thirsty here. Well, we can get our uh, water skins filled. Uh, we'll have uh, a couple apples. Can't seem to get any warmer, huh? Strange to think that this is part of White Run. I guess Fall Creek can't have all the picturesque villages. No, no, it can't. Let's go talk to uh, Lucan first. See what I can offload. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. Yeah, we helped them out. Riverwood Trader is back to Bleak the Falls. To be. We did Bleak Falls at like level seven and eight. It was no cakewalk. It was tough. Uh, do you have any water? Of course. Ah, sweet for free. That's even better. Hey, uh, I got some things to trade with you. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Yeah, that's pretty much what I have. You have anything decent? You do not. He doesn't even have any uh, cure poisons. Jerk. Okay. Um, take that, take that. He's got six gold. Fuck. <laughs> 
that sucks. He really has nothing else I want, right? Because I can make better potions than this. That's actually pretty good. And let's buy the stamina potions off him. And can you afford that? How about a woodcutter's axe? Because that weighs 10. Mm. All right, good man. Lucky for you, that was just sitting there for the taking. I didn't take anything. Lies. Lies, I tell you. Hey, uh, Alvor. Whatever you need. Buy you smear if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. Uh, good to know. Oh, you're not open for business yet. Good day. Well, you suck. And I put all my alchemy stuff in there too, didn't I? Hold on, let's see what time it is. You can't actually check the time outside unless you know on the clock what it is. It's 11.03 a.m. Why is he not open? He can't be on his uh, lunch break yet. Do you just not want to talk to me because I'm a high elf or what? Looking for a new blade? Yeah, I was. All right, then. What about your apprentice? Where's Fromir? There's Embry. All right, well, Lydia, I gotta give this back to you. We're going to Brittleshin. Um, yeah, you take take my axes, and then I'll just give you all this stuff back again. Unfortunately, need that. Okay, 246. We're good. Let's go. Um, we're rested. We'll sit. All right, we're good. Let's go this way. Back door to Brittleshin. That didn't sound right. Get our fire and our soul trap ready. Just in case. And let's make a save. I also downloaded the same. Oh yeah, I love it. That's the nice thing too. I, I don't even need to make a patch for her edits with my setup because I'm not using a, a Lydia overhaul. It's uh... Yeah, it's kind of a nightmare how that how that works. That's uh, that's no bueno. Um, oh, that worked. That worked real nice. Fire salts. Which means I think there was a mage here, right? Yep. Ah, yeah, see? See what you get? Here. You come with me. Pick up your dagger. You good? Alright, come on. We were already... We were past Anissa's cabin. So, I should have enough potions for this. Oh, I didn't even have my hood on. So one ice rune takes out an Atronach, huh? And I don't even have it empowered. 
good to know. Brittle Shin may be deadly. Let's see. Where is it up here? It's up here. So yeah, we are going to be using all three elements. Um, I may use some utility spells like uh, I heard that bear before. Let's just leave him alone. There's a lot of high level uh, necromancers in here. Shut up, Lydia. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of high level necromancers in here. See that? Alright, we took care of the runes that were here. But let's, um... Can I dual cast this? I should be able to. Let's make a save. Ow! Should probably heal myself, shouldn't I? There she is, level 50. Oh boy. For blood. For glory. Yeah, we're running. And I'm on fire. I love a good fight. I'll have your head for a trophy. God damn it. She's got the staff, see it? Come on. Does she She raised my soul. This is new. Gods, what has the world come to? When I lose a fight to a lowly skeleton? Yeah. I must return to Brittleshin Pass to reclaim my honor. So shield, uh, debuff inflicted. Shield scattered. Shattered. Shield shattered. Wow, I can't say what that. What can I do for you, friend? Oh, we're in Falkreath. What did they take? Oh, we're at 340. I still have the Staff of Worms. Looks like I have all my regular stuff. Did they not take anything? Track down the skeleton who almost killed you. Return to Brittleshin Pass where you were defeated. And collect the bounty. Okay. How are my needs? Let's have some beef stew. We haven't been to Falkreath yet. Teacup, the hall is filthy. Uh, See to your cleaning. Excuse me. Yes, sir. Is be mindful. My maid Tikla has been known to pass information to that pompous nephew of mine, Sidgear. Oh yeah. Good to know. Mind what you say. The Empire has ears all over this town. Good to know. See how easy it is, just to you know one shot. Gotta love Requiem. Well, we can at least sell some of that stuff, right? Enemies and ears. Both are everywhere. Enemies and ears, huh? Alright, Lydia, come on. Let's, uh... Let's go see the... Smith here. Uh, you have some things. I would like to sell some of this stuff. Uh, 
Oh, she doesn't have the armor. Okay. Never mind. I'm an idiot. Uh, but let's see. La, do you have anything good, enchanted? I'm loyal to Dengir first, and the Empire second. To Dengir. I think I met him. Hmm. Blades, helmets. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Yeah, he doesn't have anything useful. Look at the yeah, smile on his face. He's just like, yeah. All right, great pine goods. <clears throat> Saw bagel back. Let me know if you see anything you like. I crave ass and beef, and I'm all out of beef. <laughs> nice. Well met. Unlike my brother, I've no dislike of strangers. Met lots of them while I was a stormcloak. Oh, you were a stormcloak? I was once, but not anymore. I was wounded in a skirmish up near Windhelm. This was years ago, mind you. Interesting. Now maybe I don't pick up a blade in Ulfric's name no more, but I still hold with his ideals. Skyrim is Nordland, and we ought to rule it. We I... don't need no help from the Empire on that count. I don't disagree. Okay, one second, guys. I'm gonna... Put some water on for another cup of tea. Yeah, I switched, I switched. Today, I just wasn't feeling the coffee this morning. So, uh, Soloff, let's see what you have for sale. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Uh, well, I'll, I'll be the judge of that. Ooh, adept. So this is basically what I have, just the Necromancer version, 200%. So, um, man, you really don't have anything, do you? I could, well, I could use that. We, I think we have Absorbing Grasp. Do you have anything else? Alright, here. Take this staff. Targets won't flee. Oh, I, I mean, I could, that's like a, what's, what's it called? Um, jeez, not Pacify. It's the uh, illusion one that buffs your allies. I know, like, Lucian uses it all the time. If you teach him to use it, it's very helpful. Uh, but that's not going to help Lydia whatsoever. And the steel... Oh, you don't have any more gold. Jeez, dude, you're broke. He is broke, broke, broke. Here, just take the raw meat. I'm not getting much for that anyway. We'll keep the venison. I don't need raised dead one, I have it. And uh, take that, and you're out of money. Steal anything from my oh, shop, boy. and you'll regret it. Are we good, Lydia? Back out to Skyrim. I have to listen to hear if it's going to whistle or not. So there should be a carriage over here, too. Thistle. It's actually up on the road above. A good place for mushrooms is Halder's Cairn, which is right up there. Um... We'll, we'll eventually come back there. So, I would like to go to Riverwood again. I'm going to have to tweak that setting how, like, when the followers catch up to you, they don't collide with you. I know there's a nice mod that fixes that, but you can, I think you could do it in Nethers as well. I just I haven't looked at the settings, so... Alright, are we tired? Now we're rested. And now we're hungry, of course we are. Uh, so since we're going to be doing this... Is it cabbage soup that magically regenerates a little faster? Yeah. Well, 
we'll have some water. Alright, take two on this, huh? Oh, and... Because it's a pain in the ass. Where's my staff of worms? Can we cross here? Ah. Oh, it's cool and refreshing. Well, that, that's all that matters, I guess. Wrong place, wrong time. Um. Ah, the staff is useless. I'm useless. The whole world. Old is useless. Oh, what are you doing there? Hello there. I did notice you come up. Sure you did. I was focusing my magic. On it's a nice little staff you got there. I don't really know what I'm doing. Uh, yes, it's painfully obvious you don't know what you're doing. You don't have to tell me that. See, my grandfather. It's one of the options. <laughs> my father wouldn't talk about it much. I found some of his things in the attic, including this staff. After that, I thought I was turning into a wizard, too. Because dead things near me would come to life again for a while. I, I like this guy. They just laughed at me. The magic is in the staff, not in me, they said. Huh. Just checking on my tea. Don't worry about that. Uh, well, I'm not going to pay him for it. Why, uh, yeah, why don't you give me the staff before you, uh, wind up hurting yourself? Okay, okay. You've talked me into it. In fact, See? Keep it. Hey! Must put them fists down. The the staff I don't want to get fisted today. Dumb stick of wood now. <laughs> Aspiring mage. Yes, that's a wolf. <gasps> See that? And he's got a soldier. I can't steal it from him, though. Can I? Alright, well, that's fine. So the nice thing about this is that I believe I got killed outside, so I don't have to go in to get all my stuff. Or whatever they took from me. I do want to... I want the Staff of Hasadoki. It's just really hard as a mage to, uh, to get that. And I know I have a level up, but the level ups don't work like they do in base Skyrim. You don't gain all your health, magic, and stamina back. You do level up, um, and you get to pick a stat and obviously choose your perks like normal. Um, you know, we may as well... See, this is where I kind of wish I had a, uh, a cloak. Because there are some nice things down here. Look at that. If I'm not killed in the process, where's the treasure chest? I'll give that to Lydia. Come on. Come on for some air. Really think you can take the two of us? Any more? I think there's some on the other side here. Yep. Okay. Let's get out of the water. Dripping wet. Yes, I see them, Lydia. Oh, you know what I have? And I think I took it off the favorites because I wasn't using it. Uh, Elemental Flare. It's an AoE. Ah, uh, you know what? Screw it. I'm not wasting my magic on them. I mean, I guess I did, but... Whatever. <laughs> and I probably should have taken some potions before I went in here, too. Would have been the good thing to do, right?
Make sure we reach on our stamina. So yeah, it looks like the outside here. Oh, if it's clipping on the inside to where I can't get it. Sweet. Alright. Um, staff, is, it sells for a decent amount. Alright. And I forgot I got these destruction potions too, don't, don't I? Okay. Let's make another save here. Alright, let's restore some magicka. Let's get this going. I'm gonna have to trap these guys. Um, man, it's tough because... And I keep, again, I keep forgetting about Unrelenting Force. Gonna have to go Lightning Bolt. Or, I'm sorry, fire... Well, because there's, there's minions, sadly. See how the torch was all the way in and I, I would have never been able to get it? Alright. Let's go take two with this. They're right in this room. Come on, Lydia. Ah, jeez. Useless. Here they come. There she is. Come on, I gotta have something. Oh, I could paralyze her. Oh, if I can get this off. Um, where's the good one? This one. Nine seconds. Fuck. I'm bleeding out. I didn't even think about using Paralyze. What's up, X? Welcome in. Can a dragon really blow fire from both ends? Indigo the Brave. Yes. The answer to that is yes. Damn, she is tough. I forgot to use resist fire. Short of killing me, Lushak Gra Ragdam has made it abundantly clear to stay out of Brittleshin Pass. And we're tired. But the problem is, I need to get my stuff back. So, let's throw back that on. Uh... Oh no. Okay, we have our hood. I wasn't looking at the right. Okay. Six. Thank you. Staff of Worms. Oh, boy. Alright, let's get some food. I believe you have a certain amount of time, and then they get bored of you, and they're just like, well, screw this. Now we're a bit thirsty, huh? Hydrated. And, uh... Raveling again. I'll tell you, this is not easy. Yeah, oh, they took a lot of my stuff. She probably took all my... She probably took all my good stuff. My soul gems. You're not much of a warrior, are you? Uh oh. We could remedy Don't that go at to some the blue point palace. Like. The master is on vacation. Don't listen to... The master has gone, but Dervenin will find him. Dervenin should not have gone. Hello! Who's there? <laughs> Oh, that's an easy soul gem. <sighs> I 
Uh, I'm kind of waiting for my brother, but he's not coming until approximately an hour or so. Family day today, huh? How's it going, X? A high elf traveling with a Nord. How about that? Welcome in, buddy. Happy to have you in. We're we're attempting Brittleshin Pass, um, because we're trying to get the staff of Hasadoki. Um, we're failing. I'm I'm failing. Miserably. And never left. I'd like to visit Cyrodiil someday, though. My father told me to visit Westwald before the Thalmor invade again. But we're gonna try and do it. We're on a little on the tired side, but I think we can do it. What I'm not doing is I'm not prepping myself before I go in. She's got fire. She's got a cloak, and she's got a pretty deadly um. Firebolt spell. And it kind of makes me want to kill the bear and take the bear and I don't know where he is. He's down here somewhere. Still here? No, he's not here now. Go figure, right? White Run will always be my home. But I'll admit that this is one of the loveliest holds in Skyrim. It is. There's my old backpack. Hopefully they're not out in the front again. Otherwise I'm screwed. Oh, you dislike South Fringe? Well, oh, well, this is Brittleshin. So. You're safe. All right. Let's, uh, let's get the ice rune, the lightning bolt. Let me try and prep myself here a little bit. Um, just in, I don't think there's frost, but we'll take it. Shock, just in case. Do I have fire? Let's regen some magicka. We have fair. Let's hotkey that. Stamina, um, I'll hockey that. I don't have any fire. Oh man, we we are gonna get into so many fucking adventures, dude. Let's go tag team some bitches. Yo, you want you want to go tag? You didn't want to. Kurokasuni. Oh, That's the next best thing. Appreciate the follow. Welcome into the shadows. And on the silver tanto, I have one paralysis. It's only for two seconds. Just in case. Alright. Now, for spells. Uh, let's go back to the favorites again. Um, I want my rune. And I want... Firebolt. And F5 save. We'll turn the light on. <laughs> They're already on the move. There's my backpack. Can I raise you? Can't raise that guy. Get it, Lydia. Good job. Set a trap for her. Maybe lightning bolt will work a little bit better. Oh, there she is. I love Shit. I'm no stamina. And I know I favorited those, but um, what's the best health I have? 13 for 10, Magicka, and I'm just going to bust out a Remarkable. I cannot rest you. Oh. 
Got her. Oh, she's got Ascendant. We're not done. We take the two of us. We're not done. Uh, but we are going to save after that. Apex Predator, Randy Orton. Get up. Do my bidding. <laughs> Staff of Hasadoki. If target dies within 62 seconds, fills a soul gem, knocks the target back on impact. Check this shit out. Ready? I'm going to put this on number one. Uh, if I can find it. It's pretty nice. And it creates a ward when you're not doing anything with it. Human heart that I can't take? Hey, Zora. Who's that? Oh, that's Lukash. Debuff removed. Shield shatter. Sweet. Arcade the enemy? Elite. Absolutely. And binding. We'll take that book. I'll even take your boots. I'll leave you naked. Hi, Zora. Yeah, all these skeletons that have the hoods seem to have this issue. Look at all the black gems. I guess they let Zora out of her cage. I do have the interesting NPCs patch, so I don't know why she's not in her cage, but... It is what it is, right? Hey, there we go. You're free! Summon Swarm, huh? So let's see this gear. So the Ascendant, Magicka by 100, health is decreased by 30. You take 35% less distance uh, damage from Absorb spells. So it's decreasing my health, which sucks. And the robes, Conjuration lasts longer. Increase Summon Limit by 1 for lesser, okay, or reanimated. And then what's the Elite? 20%. 20. Oh, so Ascendant's better. 85. I don't like that health decrease, though. We may wear this, but this may be later. That, And we're going to wear the Ascendant, obviously. Um, 100 health, or 100 Magicka is fantastic. Just not right yet. Oh, you're welcome, X. Uh, I was once sent there from that guy in Falkreath to get his journal. Oh, yeah, Priest of RK. South Fringe can be deadly. Oh, you could break them down. Oh, sweet. Soul Slayers and Binding. Well, they're the same thing, so we'll keep the more expensive one, and we'll get rid of this one. And then for Elite, uh, we'll keep Ascendant, and we'll get rid of Elite. Right. Nice. I don't have anything to put them on right now, but sure. <laughs> well, that works out nicely for me. And you, my friend, F to the 5, you're coming with me. I probably could raise you too, couldn't I? Oh. She went back in her cage. Okay, we're gonna leave Zora in here for the time being. Let me let me backtrack here. Who is this? This was Avara. Okay, so Avara and somebody named Lou. Hi, Lou. I don't know who Lou is. Where's the uh, where's the tripwire? Damn. RK's the enemy. 
We don't like RK. Oh, nice. Minor Conjuration. Perfect. Sort of lucking out with these. Interesting. All right, let's um, let's buff this up. Let's trap some souls. Anything here that I might be able to use? Bone meal, soul gem fragment. Not really. Oh, she's back out again. Okay. Oh, health. Thank you. Destruction. Thank you. Alteration, thank you. And we'll even take the book. Yes. Yes, yes, all the yes. This is so worth it to come here. So that health enchant, um, I mean, you can't put it on boots, obviously, but let's see how good it would be uh, with the black solar, you know. Do we have a grand? Yeah, we do. I want to say it's 30. That'll offset my my hood. Which means we'd have to put it on a necklace. Alright, who's down here? Archers. See ya. Are there more? Oh, dude, you just... Direct them. Fighting is a good way to lose weight. Steel dagger. We could take that. Now, didn't they put another... I, I always thought there was another enchanter over here. I guess that's mod added from something else that I don't have now. And, ooh, messed that up. Come on. Isn't there more hanging moss up here? Or am I just insane? I'm probably insane. Alright, cool. Brilshin. We've, uh... Let's see if I could do it on the skeleton here. See how it pushes them? You could even do that to giants. It's crazy what it can do. <laughs> it's so good. You don't have a light. You can't see where you're going. All right, Lydia. Right behind you. I know. Um, I'm gonna give you a bow because the other part of my job. I'm back with Java. Java sounds good. Take these, and you should be good. Let's go. All right, let's make a save. Give me one second. Oops, sorry, I'm going to grab my tea. I'll be right back. Two minutes. Two seconds. Alright, it was like 15 seconds. Sue me. Ah, boy. Okay. Uh, can we sleep here? I know there's a bedroll back there. Let's make a campfire. We haven't done that yet. And I believe she's got my firewood. And she's got my tent. We're on the wrong side of Brittleshin. This is where the uh, Saints and Seducers camp is, so... Thinking of going in there might not be the safest thing to do, but I'm no. on your back. Let's see. Is it safe to... And maybe it's... Okay, we seem to be okay. 
Maybe it's because I have the extended cut. Perfect. Okay. Uh, Lydia, you have my firewood. Lydia, come here. Right behind you. I need. Uh, I need my firewood, please. And some linen wraps just to start the fire. Cool. Uh, let's make it realistic. Place it right about there. So we haven't used the campfire mechanic yet in my game. Uh, we'll skip the tutorial. I've done this a million times. Uh, we'll add some kindling. And we're going to use a linen wrap. And we're going to strike the stone. Although, I, you know what? Well, see, this allows you to get the crafting perks. This also improves your destruction. But I do want to use the campfire mechanics uh, because there are some very good buffs uh, with it. It's actually quite a nice night out if it's, you know, not just cloudy. Sweet. Um, let's add some more firewood. Make a flickering, a crackling, and a roaring. You always want to get the uh, best that you can. Alright. So now, let's check my skills. Skip the tutorial. I mean, if you need the tutorial for this, there's something wrong. Alright, we have nothing for that. Let's go to the next skill. Adaptation. I have two perks. Increase warmth rating by 20. Thank you. Yes. And Frost Word. So this will... Um, this works on Frost Spells. Which, as a mage, if I get hit with a Frost Spell, I can't move if I don't have stamina. So this helps. I am absolutely going to take that. So we're 20%... or 20 points warmer. And 25% more resistant to... Frost. Frost everything. And we've got nothing here. Is there any more? I don't think so. I think there's only two trees in my game. Yeah, there are. Alright, exit. Uh, let's lie down. And how are my needs? We're well sated. Alright. Uh, no, we don't want to wait. We want to sleep. We'll get about eight hours. Immersive creatures. Immersive creatures is solid. I like IC. SIC, I guess. It's technically what it is. Okay. Oh, did you did you fall down? Let's get some breakfast here. What are we gonna have? Some stew of the beef variety. And a green apple. Perfect. How you doing, Lydia? Let's pack that bad boy up. Put the fire out. Destroy it. Right behind you. Give you back the firewood I don't need. Although they really don't weigh much. What does she have on her? Oh, she's got my axes, and then this is all the stuff that... Alright. Do I have anything else that I want to... It's just the stuff to sell. Okay. We might be able to make... You, well, see, here's the thing. With the Ascendant Necromancer robes, even though I get the increased summon limit by one, I don't have the Magicka regen. Which is sort of a problem. Because um, right now, I've got Necromancer robes of recharging, even though they don't have the nice cool runes on it. Uh, but I have 200% regen. I think there's a version that gives you regen on them, but I'm not 100%. Maybe maybe the Ascendant's the best you can get. I don't know. 
Why don't I have my boots on? There's my fire resistance right there. What the hell? I'm, I'm wearing bloody black boots. Oh, because they're the same thing. Alright, I'm going to have to give these to you as well. Still here. To hold on to. So I don't accidentally equip them. Alright. Cool. Well, we did that. That's a thing. You, my friend, you can come with us. Yeah, he's got a... You don't buy into all that Thalmor nonsense. He's got an axe right. and a shield. He should be good, right? All right. Uh, barley dar- Oh. Ho! Oh, shit! Zombies! Alright. Um, was not expecting that. Okay, there's a bunch of zombies here. The hell is hitting me. That's not cool, man. Not cool. All right, what'd they hit me with? Brain rot? Oh, screw that. I have cure disease. Or I should. Yeah, I got five of them. All right, you bastards. And I have no magicka. Hi, boys. I didn't trap your soul. Let's uh, let's get ice run out. Here, have at it. Oh boy, the Khajiit. I hope I didn't aggro them. Nice, mort flesh. You should be more careful. I out you're right. Hey Rasad. Thanks for the assist, buddy. <laughs> oh my god, I'm sorry, that's funny. Uh Rasad, what have you got for sale? Take a look. All right, I can offload some of this stuff to him. Uh, I like the staff of zombies. This, this. We're keeping that. Did I make anything else? Damage health. Um, those are kind of useless. Damage stamina, I don't need. Damage magic, I don't need. Uh, we're never gonna get that close. If I am, I'm gonna paralyze them. Keep alteration. Definitely keep these. Oh, the skooma. I don't need the skooma. You could have that. And this is actually paralyzed as well for two seconds. Any other spell tomes? Undying ghost I don't need. Huh? I'll start to keep my gems. I don't need the fragments, I don't think. What do you have on you? You have some interesting things, don't you? Goblin totem staff. Firebolt. To health and half to magicka. Oh, it's chain lightning. Alright, never mind. I do have some gold, but I'm saving it for training. <sighs> Shield of major... Oh. And I could give this to Lydia. And that's the blocking enchant. I will take a cure disease. Do you have any cure poisons? They never do. They never do. Uh, but moon sugar I need. 
Man, too bad I don't have anything else to, to really sell. I mean... I'm only getting six for this. Rip-off artists. Weakness to Magicka? I don't need that. All right. May your road lead you to warm sands. Yeah, I hope so. I think it's time to leave. I think it's you time to leave. You should be more careful with your spell casting. I can't. Uh, I can't heal Lydia, but I can sure as hell heal him. There were more of them, right?